welcome to Tech Chanmit. In this session, we will cover further values from RTVSSL command. So, in order to explain the same, I am taking the program in edit mode. Now, here you can see that we have declared three variables. So, these variables you can declare by referring the IBM official website and post that you can directly use your command. So, to use the command, you can directly write RTVSSL and then press F4. Now, here on this screen, you are supposed to pass two parameters. First one is the system value and second one is the variable where, where you want to hold the output. Now if you want to learn more about this fields like what all values we can retrieve from here then you can press F1. So once you press F1 it will open a help screen from you for you and which will help you to uh, get the description of the all possible value that we can retrieve from the RTVSSL command. So in short you can say that it will provide you the all possible outcome that we can retrieve using the RTBs as well. Okay, so from here you can directly use, uh, you can copy the field name after getting the information regarding the particular field and then you can simply utilize in your program. Okay, so these are the values that we have already covered in previous session. So today we are going to discuss about this value which is QUSE ADPAUT which means defines the user can create define which user uh, can create change update program and service program with with the use add ADP authority star yes attribute when a program or service program has a has a use adopted authority attribute of star yes the program service program can use an adopted authority that is being passed to fit it from a program service program higher in the call stack okay so you can see that there are lots of uh, possible values so these are the value that we can retrieve from this and you can read it like existing program service programs created with the user adp authority star yes attribute user are responsible for de deciding which existing program service program should be changed to have user adoption authority star no Restoring in a restoring a program service program that use adopted authority these program service programs can still be restored on your system Duplicating a program service program that uses adopted authority the user adopted authority attribute of the existing program service program is copied to the new object Okay, so this is how we will get the information now the next field we are going to discuss today is QUSR LIBL which means user part of the library list Changes made to the system value take effect for the jobs started after the changes made. So this is all about user library list. Now the next value we are going to discuss is QUTC offset. Indicates that number of hours in 24 hour format and minutes that are the current system time is offset from the coordinated universal time. What are the possible outcome? Plus HHMM means that the current system time is hours and minutes ahead of UTC minus HHMM means that the current system time is hours and minutes behind UTC so this is how we got the information now we got the information just simply hit enter and pass the value along with the variable where you want to hold the output and then hit enter likewise we are retrieving the other two values so now we got the values in respective variable then we are go going to print it so for printing we are using sndpgm msg command then press f4 and here you can pass the variable which you want to print so we printed these three values now let's see what output we are getting for this program compiled successfully now i am going to call this program so first output is star none second is qgpl qtem game as 400 and third one is QUTC offset so this is how we can retrieve the system value using the RTVs as well command I hope this session is clear to all of you so thank you for watching Tech Chairman.